Sea Chief Meteorologist Ginger Z also visited this area, and as you can remember, she rode out the storm here in Mexico Beach in a condo. Now she got to ride, ride along with our Chief Meteorologist Ross Whitley through Panama City today, and here's a look at what she had to say about her visit back to Bay County. The downtown, so we're on Harrison, um, and the day of we came out, and all of these shops and stuff they had been boarded up, but a lot of the stuff was just all torn down. There was water coming out of the drain pipes up here. You drive through Panama City, and I was still stunned. Mm -hmm. I was here in December and was like, wow, but that's two months, so there's a lot of work to be done here. Oh, yeah, well, there was buildings here, um, and they're gone, and then you realize. These are people's lives. Yeah. This is about people. Yeah. That's and uh, humans. And and you know, you were at Mexico Beach, so you yeah. you know yeah. you saw firsthand where the yes, water got to. I saw it two days afterward. Mm -hmm. But I will say that once the surge happened and it was thirty seconds, I'm telling you, by the time it covered the water and it went to fourteen feet, it was thirty seconds. Wow. But yet at the same time I was impressed in Mexico Beach to see some of the construction right. already yeah. rolling. Um, so there are places that are doing it. It's just such a dichotomy of having the house that was fully looked like nothing like it happened yesterday mm -hmm. next to nearly done construction of a brand new home. I get a lot of messages from people saying, We feel forgotten. Do you mm -hmm. think that's the case? I understand that complaint. I think it's different when you look at it from the weather standpoint because Michael's in the history books forever. Sure. It's never, like, that's never going to be taken out of the history books. Mm -hmm. And I think the people feel forgotten, but the storm won't be. So, yeah. Do you think that that's what's important about this story? Like why you guys want to come back here and highlight this? I think the magnitude of the storm is important. I think that the people I met in the storm changed the way I look at chasing hurricanes always. But I think that's, so me being there, watching the surge, concerned that life was ending right in front of me. So we wanted to not just parachute in to the storm, be here for a couple of days, take off. We needed to follow up. 